Hi to all. Welcome to the second tutorial on the Icecube form finder. Today we will see another kind of uh, mesh creation tool and this is the uh, polar, the conical surface. The options we have on the toolbar are the same as the quad mesh so I will not talk about those. We just start and input the boundary of our conical shape so I will input the same points as the as the eye part and then uh, C on the keyboard to close as soon as we close uh, the boundary uh, the program is asking us to click on the um, on the center point of the conical mesh and that's it so you see we have created um, a conical shape as we click again on the conical shape and we have the same controls as before uh, but now we can we have a, a, a new one and that's the radius of the conical shape so I will change it to 0 0.3 and you see as soon as we change it the software uh, relaxes the mesh and we have the conical shape clicking on the mesh we have uh, a gizmo on top of the cone so we can move the cone downwards like that and uh, so with the arrow we move the shape uh, we can slant it by using this point here so we can change the direction of the conical shape let's change the stress of the warp so we can get we, we can change the uh, the weft stresses so what I have done I have increased the weft precess and that basically means the stress in the radial rings so increasing the stress the curvature of uh, the shape has changed all the other controls are the same so we can click on an edge and uh, convert it to a beam element like this uh, beam uh, to arch like that and again to uh, beam element and let's convert those so we have done this and that's very 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 simple again we can move if we want to reset the ring we can click on this reset the ring and the ring becomes uh, horizontal and then we can use these controls to move it in outside of that original plane like this okay so very very simple and straightforward um, let's try to copy this. I want to show you now how to merge two cones on a shared edge. This is valid for any uh, membrane. I will... Uh, let's make a copy of this one. So I will use the tool uh, rotate and copy yes. Right click to confirm the selection. So I want to rotate it from here around here that's it so we have two shapes now this edge is a beam I can click it to convert it to a cable let's click on this edge and to cable and click on this other edge and to cable and now they have been merged together here it is we see that it's not a beam anymore but these two meshes are connected to the common shared edge that's it so thanks for watching